The original video is linked in the description down below. Enjoy. All right, then. So in this one, what you're going to see is the police grab and stick a man in the back of the police car over allegations of don't know what. But he's claiming he went in to get a vape, and that was it. So we'll just get straight into it, and we'll break it down. I'll get a nick down on YouTube, look. Now we're in the back of a police car, right? Now we're in the back of the police car, I'm gonna laugh, mate. Look, because a guy's like, me, And I was about to go get a vape. This is what we call a Sunday day, mate. So I say hello. Say hello to YouTube. No, I'm not gonna say hello to YouTube, stuff. Alright, so I don't do nothing wrong. Well, sir, we're establishing that, sir. Just go look at the cameras. That's what we're doing just now, so that's my problem. Fine, yeah, and you'll okay. see what I'm on about, yes. That's what I've seen just now, You sorry. got me, you grab me for no reason. He's that you'll be like, now, hey, look, I've just got me, I'll let go get a vape. Didn't do nothing wrong, I've got everything on video, mate. Hey, I subscribe, mate. I'd rather not. However, sir, what I will ask, see the video you've shown no, us sorry, there? No, sorry, mate. No, yes. that's fine, see the video you've shown us there. Yeah, that I didn't do does... nothing wrong. No, 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 what I'm asking you, right, that video shows a certain amount of interaction. Yes, and you'll no, see no, the no, start of it. Will you let me finish what I'm saying? Yes, right. you'll see the start of it. So I'm asking yes. you, do you have a video of the start of it? Yes, you will, you'll see it on the camera. No, do you have a video of the start of it? You said you've videoed... No, I videoed it with touch of it, will it be on this camera, mate? No. Go rewind the video. That's right, I'm just asking if you have a copy of that. Go rewind the video. Sir, sir, hey, sorry, uh, mate. Don't tell me what to do, I'm asking wrong. you a question. Alright then people, so remember, you're innocent until proven guilty and you do not have to prove you're innocent, it's down to the police to prove your guilt. So, say nothing, don't tell them anything, let them establish the facts and then see where it goes from there. He is trying to get this person to stop recording and show him the footage. You're under no obligation to stop recording the police and you're under no obligation to show the police any footage you have on your phone. Until they get a warrant, they are not entitled to look through your phone. Unless if they use a terrorist act, and then they can use special measures under a terrorist act to go through their phones and stuff like that. Question, right? Go look at his camera and rewind I'm it. I'm asking you the question. Do you, done have, wrong. Do you have the Why? He's all that? bored on a Sunday. I've not done anything wrong. Why have he's all grabbing me for no reason? Because he set a panic button off. Because he's... Seen how surrounded here. Look, this is funny, mate. See, try to buy a vape on a Sunday day. Nothing wrong. Yeah, I'll tell you what happened, right? I wound him up and had a joke with him. See, about a week ago, I stayed across the road. Right? So he's like, get, get, get. I said, like, yeah, I've not nothing wrong here. There's money, just give a vape. He's like, get, get. So I started having a laugh. I turned my camera on on YouTube and all that. And he started going off his door and pressed the panic button. <laughs> I swear to <down. laughs> He got me, lad. Fuck you know, it's Sunday day mate, I only stay there mate, I give you my details mate, you know what I mean? But then I'm getting grabbed for no reason, listen I'll So if this person's story is true, and the person in the garage has pressed a panic button, what he keeps saying, and all these officers have turned up, then maybe he should be getting done for wasting police time, wasting police resources, Um, there's another offence about false police reports and stuff like that. But, the police probably won't do that, they've got this person in there, because they've got this person in there, they want to try and do him for something. Did you see how many there was? I walked up there, and I seen the police coming, I walked back down again. Who got me? Who does he stay? In a house down the street next to a lamppost. Nah, for your dream, mate. Nah, stay across the road. Uh, just right. across the road, mate. Oh, Next day, uh, Imperial Bar, mate. So I come here to go get a vape because it's wait. Sunday and I should be. I don't think you're welcome, mate. Can we just get a note of your details and then you'll be on your way? No. Don't right. have to give you my details. Why? Because see, I think this is funny. I don't have to give you my details. Do, do I, do, it, right, am I getting detained or getting arrested? I get oh. detained or arrested for anything? Oh. Nope. Don't have to do anything. Nope. This is why I think it's funny. Don't have to do anything, mate. By law, mate, I don't have to give you nothing, mate, because I've done nothing wrong. Am I getting detained for what? Am I detained? You're I can just, just walk out here and walk off. Are you going to let me speak at any point? Carry on. I just told you. Drugs or What's that? Have you taken drugs? No, I've, I've been drinking. Are you sure? Me, I don't take drugs, mate. Don't smoke weed, don't take cocaine, I don't take drugs, mate. You know what I mean? I, I like football, I'm hyperactive. Because I've seen my... So, like I said... Uh... They're going to try and pin him up for something. I'm glad he knows he, he doesn't have to give him nothing. Because, like this officer said, I'm going to take your details and then you're on your way. That's not how it works. That is not how it works. You can't just stop anybody and request details. Or even if there's not 
have been alleged crime. You got to figure out if there has been a crime before checking any sort of them, any sort of details. And then, like I, like I said at the beginning, they are gonna try and pin him up for something. Now they're saying, is he on drugs? No, he's been drinking. He said that immediately. And behaviour says, like, is, what? Would you not be hyperactive, surrounded by one, two, three, four, five? Would you not be in this? Hey, oh, chat, look, look at this, brother. Everything's calm, I'm just talking to you, mate. Oh, it's alright, lad. Do what you do, mate. Go check your cameras. I'll just sit here laughing my balls off. Know what I mean? I can't square or do anything because I make one more mistake, I'm getting nicked. Know what I mean? Right. What? Well, I've just arrived, so what, you, what were you trying to achieve in them? You trying to buy something or something? Is that what happened? Left my house, right. my vape run out. Uh -huh. I wound him up, unless he's had a, a drama. I had a joke with him about a week ago. Right. So I walked in there to buy a vape. Uh -huh. He started shouting and bawling at me. So I turned my camera on my YouTube thing that I'm doing at the moment. Right. Right, and then they started going, get it, get it, get it. So I was videoing him, so I was just, just not doing nothing wrong, which I showed the person before, right. and then ended up pressing the panic button. I think he fell out of the bike. one question I've got for you. You just said what? that you had a joke with him about a week ago, and up there you said to me, the joke about a week ago was you called him a tranny. Is that the case? No. So he's been shouting at you? you may yeah, no, he shouted. You see, that officer there is trying everything he can to do him, to have him arrested. He's saying a joke a week ago as you called him her tr a tranny. So what you're trying to say is done a ho homophobic remark or a public order offence, so you want to arrest him for it. I think he, I think you'll find he's not a 16-year-old autistic lass, and you're not going to be able to bully this one into giving up everything, or even dragging her off. This, the cop like this, it should be... Uh, ashamed of themselves going after people's going after people for hurting somebody's feelings then they wonder why the country's in such a state when it me yeah i said yeah like, i because he was having a laugh with me because i know he's i know he's uh mate you know what i mean he's having a joke and that he's probably just had a hissy fit and had a laugh mate right. and he's had a time or something mate honestly go look at the video <laughs> i'm not bothered mate yeah can i turn the radio on mate because i find this funny mate you know what i mean you know you find it funny what's, what's do you know what i'm it? saying though what's, what's funny about it because i'm surrounded by what five coppers sitting there and i would have to go get a vapor drink the rest of the stella and they're just wasting your time mate i love a good sunday Right, sweetheart. Oh, I'm joking. Right, okay, I think the sweetheart thing is maybe a bit... That's a joke, see what I mean? Right. Try to have a laugh. Right, right that's yeah, the whole point. I don't find it funny, to be honest with all you. Alright, right, I'll behave. Alright. Right. I'll behave, so no bother. Just seconds just to be carried. No, that's alright, mate. I'll sit here, right. close to it, mate. Right, no bother, lads. I do apologise. It's a waste of bloody resources. Go look, <sighs> mate. So again, five police officers for a non-crime. And then you've got them giving him attitude for saying sweetheart. All right, sweetheart, you know what I mean? It's absolutely bollock. The police are a disgrace at the moment. This is unnecessary. A complete waste of resources. They could be out actually catching real criminals what are going around stabbing people and stuff. See what I mean? They're like, you just had to move because he pressed a panic point. <laughs> and they took it from. You know what I mean? Yeah. I walked up the street when I seen the police. I walked back. Have you got me? Do you understand that? Do you think I'd walk? I'd walk back, mate, if I did anything wrong. Nope. Yeah, I still don't have to give you anything because I've done nothing wrong, and I don't know why you. Cause I, I know I'm detained for like questions and inquiries. See, by the time I'm sitting here, the shop will open. I can go get a vape. Now we'll go back and get drunk. <laughs> they got me. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm getting detained, so basically he gets done for putting a false complaint in and so like and pressing panic buttons. Is that uh, what we'll happens? We'll deal with our inquiries. Ah, uh, no bother, mate. Cheers, sir. You see, is not that's not going to happen as you can tell by that officer's reaction. So, wasting police resources and making false police reports is not that serious to the police, considering. They'd never do anything about it. This guy's just brought it up and they shut him down immediately. Is 
It's got a bloody... It's, it's the truth, isn't it, man? You keep on crying wolf. And nothing's happening. What happens when something does happen? And the police are just going to think, yeah, whatever. Or they're going to keep on turning up and turning up and turning up and more people and more crimes are not going to go with police because they're all like one person's doll keeps on crying wolf. Yeah, cheer up. You could be born in Airdrie. Slangeva. Oh, I was. It's born in Airdrie. Blackpool mentality though. Can I ask you a serious question? What noise does a giraffe make? <laughs> Nothing wrong, mate. Nothing wrong at all. I wouldn't have walked back, would I? Because there's any police and I stay across the road. Would I though? I'd have been gone, Great mate, goal. if I did anything wrong. Goal, you got me? But I don't have to give you nothing. I just went to buy a vape. Well, you just had an issue with me from the other week. And I know it's me, you know what I mean? <coughs> Drama queen. Then press the button. I'm like, why are you doing that? And they'll, she'll see in about two seconds. They'll be like, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to detain you. But the best thing is, though, Sorry, I've got ADHD, I'm a bit high factor. Hey, first week is though, see when I leave, you go, oh, sorry, sorry, and all that, and I'm sitting there, but it gets me, it gets me thinking from my YouTube anyway. You know what I mean, sir? You know what I mean, look, look, watch, watch, watch this now, you laugh when you go like that. See what I mean, watch, watch. There you go. Yeah, exactly, can I go now? Yeah. Do us a favour, don't go back in there then. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very yeah, much. Right, See you later, lad. Is that a garage up there? In the back? I don't know, I'm going to get a vape. <laughs> See you later. See, I told you. <laughs> told you. I did do nothing wrong. Sorry. So that's the end of that interaction. I'm glad this person didn't give up any details. And I'm glad he stuck to his guns. I'm pretty happy he wound him up a little bit. What I'm not happy about is the fact that he, he didn't get not one collar number. Or the station are whacked out of. And even at a call number or anything, come here to follow up on this to see what what happened to the guy what pressed the emergency button for a non crime if anything happened to him. And the the fact that there was five police officers there for a man which tried to buy a V. Where is the logic in that? But let us know in the comments down below what you thought of this interaction. As always, like the video it does up in YouTube's algorithm. And I'll catch you on the next one.